Hey everyone, welcome back to a brand new video. Today's video, we are going to be doing a testing video on the iHeart Revolution X Dr. Seuss collection. We pick up three items from this collection. They did do a bundle. I am absolutely loving their bundles at the moment on the iHeart Revolution site, Revolution site in general. I really wanted to get this because of the eyeliners and uh, these are amazing i got these three products for 20 pounds but i do believe that this is eight i think this must be 10 let me just double check how much this is separately these separately are 12 pounds i believe this is eight so i'm not quite sure i think this is eight and i think this is five so you're kind of saving like five pound i think you're saving so quite a good deal so basically you're getting the lip gloss for free which i do not mind i think this lip gloss is absolutely beautiful so let's just have a little look at what the products we're going to be testing out so the first thing we're going to be testing out is all the places you'll go i think this packaging is absolutely beautiful and these are all references of dr seuss's books i actually thought they were going to bring out a grinch collection because in january they did like a little hint and they put on their story of the grinch so i thought they're going to bring out a grinch collection but i guess they were hinting that they're going to bring out a dr seuss collection hopefully for christmas they're going to bring out a grinch collection because that would be pretty cool i really do love the palette this is such a beautiful palette i did think this was going to be kind of like a rubber because all of their mini palettes are rubbers let me just show you one is their tasty range and this is kind of like it's like a rubber i'd say so i thought the packaging was also going to be rubber but it's not which is fine and the color story in this goes so well with the packaging because as you can see they have the same colors so they have kind of matched this theme this color story pretty well i feel like um, I don't know what I'm gonna do today. I really don't know what I'm gonna do. I really do like that there that there's three mattes and there are five shimmers in here. It, they look very pretty, but I really do want to play around with the lip crayons. Lip crayons? With the eye crayons. So I don't know what I'm gonna do yet. So I need to have a little think and decide what I'm gonna do. We're also going to be testing out the lip gloss as well. This is from, oh, it's also all the places you'll go. Ah, lovely. But let's have a little look at the crayons. So you do get six crayons from the set. You can use them as eyeliners and you can also use them as eyeshadows as well. I, I don't really know how to use these as eyeshadows yet. But let me just show you what are these are what they look like. So we do have this grey one here. This is the grey one. And this one is called Hootens Here at Who. These are also movies as well. I believe that this um, one is a movie. So this is a grey. Ooh. This is a grey shade. We have this yellow shade, which is called One Fish, Two Fish, Red Fish, Blue Fish. And this is, oh, this is actually like a really nice gold. That's really pretty. Then we have Fox in Socks. I remember reading this when I was a kid, this book. I would say this one... This one is like an orange shade. They're very nice. They're like shimmers. And then we have all the places you'll go. This one is of a pink shade, I believe. Yeah, I think that one's more of a pinky shade. Then we have the Cat in the Hat. I absolutely love Cat in the Hat. I remember when I was reading it when I was a kid. I also love the film as well. So this one is a really nice blue that blue oh, that is very very nice and then we have the green one and i think this one's called green eggs and ham that's a really nice green oh i like that i like that a lot let me just quickly swatch for you the yellow one oh, that is a nice one wow and then we have the grey one. 
this one is the grey one. Oh, they are very pretty. I think what I might do is I think I'm going to try and use it as a shimmer, like on a base. I think that'll be quite nice. Now let's get into the palette. So this is the palette. These are the shades. You get eight shades. You get five shimmers and three mattes. I think today we're going to go in with, I think I might start off with this orange shade first. A very nice big pans which we love i'm gonna take this orange shade and i'm just gonna pop that all on the lid all on the lid it goes Ooh, that has gone on there like a dream i feel like this is a very nice palette i've only used one shade and I'm like, I'm obsessed. I'm obsessed with this palette already. Then we are going to take this peachy shade. And I'm just going to blend those shades together. Actually, do you know what? I'm not even going to do that. I think I like the, the orange shade as it is. Let's try this one, green eggs and ham. Because I'm, maybe they're like the same colour. Okay, these are really nice to put on the lid just like that. I did try to do a line as you can see, but it's not that bright that I thought it was gonna be. Maybe I just need to keep going over it. So I've tried to create that line. I know this looks quite of a mess right now, but just trust the process. Because I do have a kind of an idea that I want to do okay as you can see I have kind of used I've used the shade green eggs and ham and I've just literally just went over it like a pencil onto the inner corner of the eye and then I done like a line like as you can see and I've also done it for the other side. I know it looks crazy right now, but I've just got like this thing in my head that I just wanted to try and do. Um, I'm just gonna take like a little brush, this little brush here, and I'm just gonna go back in with the first shade that we went in with. And I'm just gonna try and just like blend them all out together just so it look, doesn't look very weird. I feel like it's, um, it's okay. I feel like it's quite cool like that. Don't you think that's, it's really weird? It's really weird, but um, I quite like that. Now, I think what I'm gonna take is I'm gonna go in with, this shimmer looks really nice, actually. Ooh, I think I might take this shimmer here. That looks really nice. And I'm just gonna use a flat brush. Just gonna take this brush here. I'm gonna take this shade right here. And, oh, I'm just gonna apply it. No, actually, that's quite nice. I like that. Once you, like, start laying it, laying the shade over and over again, it's quite nice. I like that. I really do like that. That's a really nice shade. That is really nice. I think what I might do is I'm going to go in with... I think I might go in with... Should I go with this blue? That's a really nice blue. I'm gonna go with the green. No. I don't know. I think I might go with the yellow. No. I don't know what to go with. I think I might go with the pink. I think I'm gonna go with the shimmer here. And I'm gonna just apply that onto the outer corner. Oh, that's pretty. I like that. Ooh, I like that a lot. Okay, so obviously the green has like disappeared. So I'm just going to go back in with my green eggs and ham. And I'm just going to do the line again. Try to do the line. That 
that is a little... Okay. Okay, girl. Cool. That is cool. I really do like that. I mean, don't look at that. That's just a bit weird. Um, that's a cool, the cooler. I'm going to go with the waterline. And I think I might go in with this pencil, which is the All The Places You'll Go. And I don't know what this colour is. I don't know if it's like a pink or like an orangey pink, brown. I don't actually know. But I'm going to go in with this shade. Let's see. Or shall we go in with this? Actually, uh, yeah. I think I might go with this one, actually. Which is the one fish, two fish, red fish, blue fish. Yeah. I think I'm going to go with this one. Um, right. I need a mirror. That is lovely. I feel like that makes your eyes pop. You like that as a underline, a waterline base. I don't know if you can see that properly, but I like that. That's really nice. It makes your eyes kind of pop. And I think I'm going to take... I'm going to take this yellow shimmer right now, and I'm just going to place that into the inner corner of the eye just to make this look more popping. As you can see, I am obsessed with this. I feel like this look is so nice. It's so different, I don't know. I mean, it is a crazy collection, so we've got that right. I have just quickly applied some mascara. I use the 5D Lash from Revolution, and now we are going to be testing out the All oh, Your Places You'll Go lip gloss i'm very excited to try this one they did have two i think they had two lip glosses i think the other one was more of a pinky side i kind of like orangey peachy lips i like this lip gloss it's very nice it has got like an orange tint to it and it is very like sparkly it feels very heavy on my lips very thick that's what it feels like on my lips um it's a little bit sticky <laughs> as you can see but other than that it's a really nice shade palette has to give me i have to give it 10 out of 10 i absolutely love the colors in this palette i feel like it's very i feel like you can use this every day you can definitely use these three shades as an everyday use but i really do like the eyes that i created today these crayons i like but they were a bit hard to apply on first i think it's because i was trying to use the same shade as i use on the eyeshadow uh, but they were very nice after i got used to them they're really nice i really do like that gold shade oh my god that shade there is so nice it's like glittering the shimmers in this palette are lovely to be honest, I feel like the mini palettes are way better than the big palettes. I don't know why, I don't know what it is, but they the formula is just so much better in the mini palettes than the big palettes. It's very nice, it's my favourite gloss, I think this is going to be my favourite. But yeah guys, that is the collection, that is the Dr. Seuss collection, and thank you so much for watching. Um, I don't know what video I'll be doing next, I think it might be another cheese video palette look because i do want to give the big cheese another go so i wish we'd do another look at that and i think i might try to do a look with the cheese collection with these um but we will see we will see but thank you all for watching and i hope to see you in my next video bye for now